Hello, everybody. We are back with more uh, Roll 'em Shoot 'em Championship uh, test out. I guess we can say scrim. Uh, we're coming at you with 4CAD versus Us Can, and it looks like these guys are going to go possibly 10v10. Yeah, we could do 10v10 now and see how it goes. So they may switch back down to uh, lower after this, but it looks like we're going to start at 10v10, Clout. What do you think about that? And I think I think 10v10 is going to be really spicy. You know, 10v10 is not something that either of these clans are really used to Familiar playing. With? Yeah, outside of playing in in leagues like map fights, so to say, like it's it's definitely going to be interesting to watch. I'm kind of interested about this 1357 pick because the spotting range in the 1357 is not the best, but it is backed up by a lichen, so it could be great. I mean. He's going to pepper somebody. If he get behind somebody, he can make them hurt. Oh, that's, uh, and like that's definitely going to be their plan. Us can also going to bring out the Artie. Oh, yeah. Crazy now, Mage. That's his, uh, that's his specialty right there. Artie and TDs. <laughs> all right, we got a Cockroach out. Now, can we have more than... I know there's no TD limit, but they could run three of the same ones, right? Correct. Three of the same. No limit on tanks by class. <clears throat> And T29 and Miniman do not count as the same for those that are newer to this kind of setting. Yeah, it is pretty different. Uh, it looks like a uh, 4CAD all ready to go. Going on a few more tanks that us can. Still not seeing a light tank from uh, from US Can here. I mean, I'm kind of. If if I were to uh, say that I know my clan, um, I'm guessing it's gonna be Wooten. <laughs> no cockroach. Well, I okay. mean a cockroach can be a lot in a way. Like if you needed yep. it. it, is possible. Now I don't know a lot about Harley's playstyle, but I don't really ever see Harley in anything but a heavy. So I don't think she would be in the light tank. So maybe uh. So maybe, yep, maybe Jules? He I don't know. Jules? But I, I, Jules. Yep, uh, he there he is. And if I know Harley, it's going to be a 29 or a minute, man. <laughs> I mean, and they I only have two 29s, so. I always see her in a heavy, so I'm just assuming she's going heavy. So I was thinking it had to be Jules. Yeah, and somebody over here on 4 Cat's side breaking up the Czech Tiger. The, the what is it, the three-shot autoloader with like a seven-second quip reload? Oh, yeah, the Tiger 1. I think it's uh, yeah. only like a five or a six second reload you can get it down to. Yeah, that's it's a it's a gnarly tank. The only issue is is that these dreadnoughts are gonna go right through it. Okay, here we go, heal brown tier seven, round Let's one. Let's get spicy. All right. Oh man, this is gonna be uh. <laughs> it's gonna be so many floor. players. It doesn't <laughs> show the tanks they're in like normal. All right. So we're just gonna have to try to go down tanks in lobby. Was not expecting this. Uh, just real quick on the four cat side, looks like I'm out with two T29s, a Minuteman, an E25, the M56, the AMX1357, a J Panther, an IS, the Tiger, one A18, and a Locket. Believe I got and it. Over, and over on US Can side, we have got a Minuteman, a Lycan, a Dreadnought. Looks like two T29s. An SG 12244, E25, T50, M12, and Dreadnought. So two Dreadnoughts, not one. <laughs> this is definitely going to be a spicy game, especially considering the objective is literally smack in the middle of the map. Yep, I'm actually kind of shocked Tardy did not go Artie here. See, I don't, I don't really know too much about about dirty other than i see her in your chat all the time <laughs> and that she's really good at the the derpies i i mean she i mean she's mostly a td player right so i mean the cockroach makes sense but i do know there was a, a arty or two bought back specifically for this possibility i don't know really okay I so like we'll that. see we'll see maybe maybe the the right tier will pop up all right so the t29s do get lit by one on buck here and they lose their spot pretty quick yeah, but no one's no one's set up to punish. So if they if they notice that, they're still able to get to that uh what is the D six area behind that mountain. Yes. Let's 
see what else we got going on here. We got the T20 making its way through the city, which is very spicy. Torch is back lit again in the T29. Looks like Heels is about to make his run for uh, for that E25 in the back here. My butt takes a yep. shot from Dragon, but it just hits the gun. Yeah, and uh, this is this is where I, what I was talking about about that camo that 1357. Heels was able to walk right up to him and not get spotted. IS doing a good job keeping himself, or uh, Red Wolf in the IS doing a good job keeping himself safe from back and front here with all these angles that US Can's got on that rock. Now, so far, only one shot of damage that went into the Tiger 1. Oh, Ooh, there goes some of the I say that, yep. <laughs> <laughs> the Minuteman did get a good bounce, uh, bounce Harley's shot from that Treadnought. Yep, Hules is now spotted. He's being forced out here. Right now, Artie did try to get a shot into the Minuteman. Now, where is Alpha Buffet? He just took a big half health shot. Oddball doing a good job, knowing that there's no light tank over there, keeping that city lit. Oh, Alpha got hit by Demon, by the way. Ah. Uh. Somebody's trying to find Wooten up there in the E25. They're blind shooting bushes here. Yeah, it looks like one odd buck. Uh, looks like Red Wolf almost took a shot from Artie right there. Oh, no. Now here comes, uh, here comes the locking in. Okay, he's going to get chased out by the TD in the back. Oh, looks like Artie did connect to Wolf that round for about half hell. Wow, that M that M12 hits, doesn't it? Man, was not expecting that. Looks like 30 is going to shift over to support this light tank here, city side. Oh my, Shell just came in on that that Tiger 1-8. The, the the tiger one looked like a very slow moving shot. It couldn't have been dreadnought though. Interesting. Had to be. I don't know. It might not have been already. I don't know. There's so much so much action to cover. I don't know where I need to have the camera. I'm not gonna. I'm literally just rotating around the map. <laughs> well, uh, US Ken's gonna have to make a move here with 40 seconds left on cap. It looks like they're mounting a yeah. push here question is which side are they gonna roll well it looks like demon's gonna come be the I mean, blunt force where these t90 t9 t29s are sorry uh they're not gonna spot them all they can do is get on and contest the cap at yep. best N unless and that so was a the well if you can get the spot you say they they're gonna have to spot these 29s it's gonna have to be tovar right here coming in, in the t20 well, here comes the, oh, the, the cap lock. Blind there it is. Ah, uh, dragon. Uh. <laughs> dragon does go down to the tiger. The tiger one and is pepper. Well, it looks like the lichens trying to make some magic happen here. Didn't even notice Heels did go down over there on that on that uh that right side. Oh, I missed that. Orch is also hey, gonna go down to lichen down. fire. Are they 18 down to 7 HP? Yeah, but 7 HP is enough to make magic happen. We both know that. No, we did miss it back over on the other side. Uh, Cupid and Dreadnought down to a one-shot. Darling went down. Cupid Dreadnought also go goes. Down. Now, what on Buck trying to make it to, uh, to Crazy Mage, but Tovar is trying to go back and cover him. Yeah, this is, uh, this is getting... What, what, what do we got here? 3,500 hit point deficit? Yep. Ooh, Mage misses the shotgun. 
and that's gonna that's gonna be his game. Oh no, the 1357 must have missed a shot. Or two. Oh, he went on reload. Yeah, because he's going to get a hit right here as he crosses. Just oh not. dang. Okay, T20 in oh, hot pursuit. <laughs> yep, there's an E25 backing him up though. Oh, but those shots are missing. Oh, wait. She wasn't aiming was at him. For the arty. She was going for the arty. <laughs> it's a very good play, in my opinion. Take out the guy that can literally one tap half the guys over there and allow your white tank to reload to support the, on this T20. That's actually not a bad move. Wooten, though, is still out here on the run in the back of almost in their spawn. See, if he plays this right, he could pick off that IS on cap, but he doesn't know it's an IS on cap. <laughs> See what Wooten can do here. Say 1v10. It's very, uh, very spicy match. <laughs> so, because personally, right, this is not a map that I enjoy. As he starts tagging that IS, though. Yeah, he might. Can he get the last two shots in? Oh, he got down. Oh, he tracked. Time. Oh, thought he nailed track. Well, that Lycan's going to come up left side here. Yeah. Uh, e25 can kill the slacking. Oh, he's, he's running. He's running. Though. Clutch break turn, bud. <laughs> oh, the ram. Yeah. He takes one on buck yeah. out <laughs> it's all about the ram kills, baby. <laughs> oh, man. That was a spicy game, though. That was fun. Well, these uh, these ten v tens are going to be uh, interesting. They're very different. So uh, over on the U.S. can side, we got Crazy Maze in the M12, 1,469 damage. Wooten in the E25 with the only kill on U.S. can side with 1,302 damage. Demon, Demon Lord Legion in the SU-122-44, 1,164 damage. Harley in the Dreadnought, 659 damage. Tolovar in the T20. 432 damage, 687 assisted. Darley in the Minuteman, 337 damage. Torch in the T29, 304 damage. Cupid in the Dreadnought, 215 damage. Dragon in the T29, only 440 assisted. And Hules ended up raking uh, 1089 assisted damage, even though you had nothing raw. Uh, over on 4 cat Red Wolf in the IS, one kill, 25-52. Uh, Twitch play in the Minuteman, two kills, 1879. Odd Buck in that 1357 with 1351. Oh, wait, Odd Ball, I'm sorry. Odd Buck in the Lycan with two kills, 1087. A uh, Bull in the J Panther, one kill, 1084. Chicken Hunter in the 29, two kills, 773. Dirty in the E25, two kills, 518. Uh, Lost Hope in the M56, 482. Peacebreaker in the Tiger with 428 and Toasty Tot in 29, 346. Well, and on, on top of all of that from 4CAD's side, 4CAD also had the only guy on the map to block over 1,000 in uh, Twitch play, which in the Minuteman, can't really say it's easy or hard, but if, if you put yeah. it in the right spot, that tank is definitely, definitely a pain to dig out. Well, I think... If I'm not mistaken, that's who took Harley's, uh, I believe it was a heat round. Um, so that mm. probably gave him like six, seven hundred, five, six, seven hundred off that one round of blocks. Yeah, so throwing man, heat I at mean, a, throwing heat at a minute, man. It's not always a good idea. It didn't look like, a, I mean, I'm assuming it was a heat round because I believe HE was just, at least got a little bit of splash damage. I believe the Dreadnought gets heat. I haven't played it in so long. I don't remember what it has. I believe it's it's H E or it's A P Heat H E if I remember right. Let's see. Okay, I'm spec. I can't go to the garage. Um, you should be able to jump into your tanks. Hold on, I'll look. You should be able to jump into your tanks tab and then just scroll onto the premium. 
Yeah, I'm doing that now. Um, premium. Your seven. My turn. Uh, there it is. Uh, and it is AP heat HE. Okay, so it does get heat. Correct. Whoa. T28 HTC. I, I could work. Uh, I have my doubts about the 1357, and Oddball shut me up, so I'm going to hold my tongue on this one and see what happens. <laughs> Because <laughs> I believe Red Wolf in the last game played uh, played the M56, if I'm not mistaken. I could 100% I mean, be wrong. I, I want to say I've seen it played in comp before, but it's been a long time ago. He did not. Lost Hope had the M56 last game. Okay. Oh, now we're going to see double R you coming to us, Ken. Oh, gosh. Darwi is another one of another one of our players. She does enjoy her artillery, but she can honestly play whatever class you put her in. Oh, by the way, for the stream, if anyone has questions about this league, you can That's go ahead wild. and throw them into chat, and I will answer them as I am also in the chat because I know this is delayed. Just at me in chat, and I will gladly answer. Yep, that's what these streams are about, guys. We're trying to get the word out, let people know this event's going on. Hopefully, get some people into the uh, into the server, get some more clans in. Uh, I think y'all have about twenty up, or you know, going to participate. Last I I saw, we've we're definitely getting a a really decent turnout, and I'm really liking seeing that, especially because uh, it's it's the first first year for the league so normally having that big of a turnout in your first year is not normal but kind of interested to see where it goes from here oh yeah oh forecad picking up an already now as well and it looks like we're uh we're moving to 11 11 oh god <laughs> by the end of the stream we might see it's gonna uh, be a 14 v 14 as I say, we're not going to be able to see full team bras, brawls, but we're going to get dang close, all right? <laughs> not really sure how I feel about the double arty pick, even though the side of the map that US can is, is going to be on is a lot more arty friendly than the north. The south side is definitely more friendly. Oh, yeah. And Demon opting out as a TD and picking up the Banshee Comet variant. I mean, I do like the tank. Uh, oh, yeah, it's, quick, a very, it's a very good tank. Oh, uh, man, right when I was going to say, let's get tank picks out of the way, they're like, let's launch. <laughs> it does math. <laughs> All right, let me get up here real quick. Uh, over on the forecast side, they got a lock at a minute man, a T29, a second minute man, the T28 HTC, the Tiger A18 is back, uh, the 1357, the Super Hellcat, the T29, the M12, and the J Panther. All right, and over on US Can side, we do have two M12s, a T20 Dreadnought Banshee, two T29s, a Bear E25, Lycan, and another T20. So there is two T20s over on US Can side, DPM. May be a huge asset for them, but they're gonna have to have eyes in order to execute, oh, yeah. which on this now, do, map uh, is very complicated. I do want to add in this is just a scrim, so these guys are running up to like an 11 v 11 right now, but I think the tournament will be the AV8 correct. Last time that I have seen the rule book, correct. Oh, Jeff's in chat, he can answer questions. Nice. <laughs> Looks like U.S. can still uh, still not wanting to give up on the city side here. Instead, they went a little bit more mobile with those two T20s. Okay, we already got some already coming out. Looks like Harley Quinn took a shot from the already. Dreadnought takes a shot. 
Yeah, Cupid is spotted back there. He definitely took one or took two, I believe, from that Lycan. No, uh, Harley just took another shot. I'm not sure who got the shot into her. It's like it may be Alpha Panther. and Jack Panther. Yep. But she does get a little bit back into him. Oh, oh, they're they're oh, trying to punish. Oh, that shot it connected. Well, it looks like uh, Odd Buck over here is trying to go in for the kill on Harley. Oh, nope, decides to circle back and mind his business here. Ooh, big hit. Oh, Harley does go down. Not really sure where that hit came from. Pretty confident it was Artie, but it was definitely a good hit. Okay, now it looks like uh, the G20s and the Bayer are set up for this A18 that tried to push down. They do get a little punish in, but it looks like he's actually going to make it out. Oh, there's a bigger shot. Oh, from there's the, another the shot. Ooh, Dreadnought shot lands on that. Uh, um, almost positive it was Dreadnought shot that landed on that T29. Lycan oh, is about to go him. out here. Keep, keep, keep. Good pushing. double tap from those T20s. Oh my! <laughs> and he's gonna come back the, the same direction. Interesting. Oh no! Oh, the big, big cat, cat kind of drove cat off and lost down. a lot of health. Yeah, that was a. It was a tactical maneuver. You gotta, you gotta get with the times about that one. <laughs> All right, now Demon and Dragon, they have a Minuteman in on them right here. Well, Tolovar, it looks like he he thought that uh that Tiger was by himself, but he's not. Now Tolovar's caught out here by himself. He might he might go down here. Oh, Big Cat's backing him up. Is Tolvar in a hole in a wall there? It mm. does seem so. Uh, looks like he's just in the uh, in the street. Little alleyway, yeah. J Panther comes in on him, gets a shot. Yeah, Tolvar bounced as soon as he came around the corner. Very bad bounce here. Good clean up by that T29. Been hit by Darley on chicken. Seems like Oddball did go down. Didn't see it happen, but he did go down. So it looks like this um, is a light tankless game now. Oh yeah, he went down over on the backside. Um, Wooten's Wooten trapped in a little in bit the, of trouble. Yep. Definitely trapped in the fire here. Now it's down to two artilleries and a, and a bear. And one of the already oh, like it does go down. Good shot by the bear. Uh, now Darley is lit. Everybody, Crazy Mage has not been lit yet, but he does have a T29 coming up on him. Yeah, he's he's put a mountain between him and the him and the opposing team. Oh no, the bear's on fire. The torch oh, has no, the torch sad lit. face. <laughs> the dad jokes are on point. Oh yeah, I learned from the best. It looks like Bear is gonna try to. Go after this J Panther, and he does get him. Nice, good shot. Now what does he got? Looks like the A18 here would have it would be giving a side. He's not lit though. Trying to get around. Artie does get Artie counter Artie a little bit. Well, when that T29, when when Toasty came around on Mage, he took two Artie shells, which put him at half health. So. Oh, and then Darley gets one into that minute man oh, as well. No. Oh my. Torch like landed another here. one. Yeah, that 18 man, it just fires so fast. Yeah, it's it's definitely a great tank at tier seven. All right, and over on the U.S. can side, we've got Torch and the Bear, two kills, 1,416 damage. We've got Mage in the M12, 1,191 damage, 608 assisted. We've got Darley in the other M12, 1,082 damage, 18 assisted. We've got Wooten in the E25, 1 kill, 850 damage. Tovar in the T20, 640 damage, 648 assisted. We've got Legion in the Banshee, 465 damage, 394 assisted. Big Cat in the T20, 439 damage, 183 assisted. Harley in the T29, 323 damage. Dragon in the T29, 
313 damage, 885 assisted. Heals in the Lycan, 288 damage, no assisted this time. And Cupid and Dreadnought, donuts. Unfortunate. Uh, over on the four cat side, Alpha back on top with that Panther, one kill, 23 22. Devil and Artie, two kills, 2009. Lost Hope in the Minutemen, three kills, 1464. Uh, Toasty in that T29, 1050. Uh, Peace Breaker in the Tiger with one kill, 900. Chicken Hunter in the T29, 723. Oddball in that 1357, 699. Red Wolf in the HGC, two kills, 626. Dirty oh in the Super God. Hellcat, Wood Kill, <laughs> 576. Uh, one Odd Buck in the Lock in 540, and Twitch Play in the Minutemen, one kill, 398. You know, when it comes to damage, I do miss the uh, simpler 7v7s. Oh, yeah, because it's really hard to pull a thousand, especially in these lower tiers when you're rolling, mm -hmm. when you're rolling this many tanks. Because it's going to be that one guy like Alpha and, and Devils up there with the 2000s and then all of your guys in the bottom are really just support roles like the like the t28 htc 626 on two kills i bet you that was on three shots it was on three shots <laughs> uh, looks like demon broke the bot demon broke the bot well good fucking going guy <laughs> How does Demon break the bot? I'm pretty confident he's probably one of the people that set the bot up. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know if that's really the issue, but it, you know, it make you know, it's easy to blame Demon. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Oh, totally lost agree. hope. Thank you for that follow, man. Oh, there it went. Okay, so I believe this is tier six. That it would be. It would be tier six, and Demon is kicking and screaming right now. <laughs> He's over there like, can I reroll? <laughs> oh, this is his roll. This is a uh, four cat roll. Oh, nice. Okay, so looks like they did a re-roll. So it looks like now we're going to tier 10. Well, no, because Legion rolled it and it wasn't his roll. That's, okay, that's what okay, happened. Okay. And it's it, since it was their roll, one, one die, six faces, rolls a six, top tier is 10. So ten, 10 is gonna be good. This is a this is gonna be a, a bigger fight, in my opinion. Let's see what map are we looking at at 35. Do if I can find the rules here. Uh, Overlord. Ew! I'm glad Tier I'm not Overlord. playing. Oh my god! I hate that map. At what are we gonna do? 10 v 10, 11 v 11. Oh well, only time shall tell. <laughs> Well, because the encounter base on Overlord, it's over there on that, that second tier up. So you've got Beach, that's tier one, and then that, that first hill, that's tier two. So it's uh, definitely in an awkward location. Oh, God. <laughs> and then the first thing we see from 4CAD, 261, 261. <laughs> Most accurate artillery I mean, at tier 10 in the game. And I mean, it's really quick. It moves 50. Okay, okay, never mind. I was about to say, we know what we can see from Demon, but they're going to use the one Avery, one Terran roll. We're not going to see what we saw last time. No, there, there's an Avery and a Terran over there on 4Cat's side. 
Yes, but they can only run one of each. They can't run triple like uh... happened last time. I don't think I was there for that one. Oh my god, Demon ran triple Terran, triple uh, <laughs> AV, Avery. <laughs> oh my god, it was just complete obliteration. That does like sound they, like they, something Demon would do. They two shot an E4. <laughs> like I think oh, they rolled him for like 400, uh, 1400 on the first shot and then they uh, ammo racked him on the second. For oh, the remaining god. like 600 or something. Well, the Fosh 155 from Jeff Bond is a very spicy pick. Because, like, yes, I, I believe the Fosh has six shells, but then you're on reload oh, it can clip, for... It can almost clip a tank. It's not that bad. It's only, like... Yeah. Well, it depends. It's only, like, 30 seconds, I think. It only... Well, yeah, I guess in 11v11 or 10v10, it's not that bad. But if we're playing, like, 7s or 8, like, 77 or 8v8, that reload's really crucial. But I guess in a 11v11, it's not going to be that bad. Because he's got a lot more tanks to cover him. Two Foshes. Oh my god. Holy auto loader. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be. Demon in that nemesis. He does love that nemesis. Got a buff today. Got that pin buff. Yep. It got a pen and a reload buff. And now reloads faster than the E4, by the way. The 750 shell. I apologize, Demon, if I just told everybody your sauce. <laughs> well, hopefully but, not. But then we've got Harley and the Lehman Russ. Uh, Lehman Russ is a very, uh, very solid tank. Um, it can be squishy if you know where to shoot it. Keyword is if. But Harley does play that thing very, very well, so I'm Really excited to see that. <laughs> Holy TD. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be pretty TD. I'm actually kind of surprised I'm not seeing any 705As over on US Can side right now. It's a very popular pick. On our side, especially where the cap circle is, it, c it could work really well into their favor if they bring one. Oh, 183. Oh my gosh. What am I seeing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're going to see everything. Oh, yeah. This is definitely going to be a lot of fun. We wouldn't bring it out of CS. But CS won't be alone. So that, uh, I feel like Big Cat's also going to bring a medium if I, if I know this team. <laughs> Three Arties on four cat side. Oh my god. <laughs> this is this, is, this is actual cancer. Oh, a nemesis from Big Cat, nice. So there's a there's a running oh, yeah. like joke in PC world of in PC world of tanks like Artie is Sky Cancer. What well, 4 Cat yeah. is playing right now is literal Sky Cancer. All right, well <laughs> let's try to get through this real quick. Uh, over on the 4 Cat side, they're coming out with one QL, the LT, the Bat Chat, uh, two Bosch, 155s, the E4, the T92, the Avery, the Tehran, double two six ones. And over on US Can side, we've got an E3, two Nemesis, a Lehman Rust, Terran, 100 LT. Avery 261, CS 63, Super Conk, and an Arnie. All right, there we go. Ooh, just in time. <laughs> yeah, I had to, I had to like, catch my breath after that one. Like, holy. <laughs> I've never liked the split spawns on this map. But the split spawns can cause a lot of action. I'm uh, kind of curious to see if we see some uh, some beach rolling. Um, especially from like that spawns. bat over there on Forcad. All right, now here we go. We're gonna see uh, now Keg or Keg Forcad is uh, kind of splitting up a little bit here. It looks like us can gonna come straight down the zero line almost. 
Well, uh, I'm pretty sure that USK knows that that's the side that the already spawned on. And considering they had three oh. and US can had one. I think I have a little bit of overmatch there. Yeah, Chicken Hunter does get them lit. We did see a couple Artie rounds come in, but nothing connected yet. Avery takes Ooh, that a small. Was, that was in uh, T92 or something like that. Definitely a big Ooh. splash show. A little bit of counter artery uh, already coming back in at the 261s. Ooh, takes 19 damage. I'm kind of curious to see what's going on over here on beach side. It looks like that entire beach spawn went ahead and decided they're just going to push. So we'll, we'll see how that works out here. I mean, beach does have an overmatch as well right now. Correct, but Ooh, they also can't cat. see anything over Down there. Down to a one shot. Right. Ooh, oh, big hit on that 100LT. I believe that was Darley or the Avery double tap. I'm not sure. But Chicken is one shot now. Very, uh, oh, oh my teammate. god, what a pen. That was a T92. <laughs> oh, and Jamie goes down finished. with the Artie. Lost Hope did get lit. Red Wolf oh, is definitely man. lit. We've been getting a little aggressive, but he's going to go down to the E4 right here. Dirty takes him out. Yeah, the Beach has got to push. I know they don't know it, but they are going to have to. They, ju they just got to count tanks at this point. Yeah. Pivar does get him lit. Oh, the Death Star going down to a two shot early. He does hit the bet chat really hard. Barley is on fire. Oh, no. Barley does go down. All right, Toasty Todd, the bat chat goes down. Tehran is getting they gotta, the focus. Uh, yep, let's say they've got to get that Tehran out. Got to, got to, got to. Yep, send in the armor. Here it goes. <laughs> I mean, it's the Avery. Does armor matter? <laughs> well... To an extent, yes. Uh, Dragon does go down over here on top side, though. Looks like this uh, this 9-0 line has been lost for US Can. It is a uh... now they're they're in a bottle over there on beach. It's a very a very uh, a sticky situation for US Can right now. Okay, they bring us down to about a two shot. Well, I don't know. For some of these tanks, it would be a one. Yep, you guys go down. Right now, these guys got to fight their way up off the beach into a Fosk 155 and a Charon. Yeah, it's definitely not a situation you want to be in. But that Fosk 155 does have a weak spot on the top now. It's a that light bar is really squishy to almost everything on that beach. So if that 183 can hit that light bar, he'll be down to like three shotable real oh, quick. No. I was about to say this lot tank is in amongst all three already, but he does get shotgun and goes down. Yeah. Does happen. All right, Harley <laughs> Quinn coming up on that VZ55. Uh, the 55 does have... Oh, nope, she turns. Harley kind of caught in a little bit of a crossfire here. But she's trying to tuck in against this rock, but she's moving really far forward, opening her up on that right side. Ooh, Fox Torch coming down, trying a to unload. Those two six ones, man. Great game. <laughs> oh, they, they definitely did their thing. And Karen gets caught Cuban, trying to escape the heat Cuban of fire here. From the ninety-two, yeah. I should be able to put a big one in the Fosh right here. Oh, big hit. Oh, the Fosh, Fosh is, is going reload though. Pick yeah, but Jeff, Bond's gonna reload loaded. here. Ron got that mobility though. He might be he able to take Alpha out with him if he does. <laughs> These guys are really fun to watch, even though I absolutely hate this map. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fun map. It used to be played, uh, we played in comp more. Not so much. Right, well, uh... Go ahead. Oh, no, I was like, 
Uh, over on the forecast side, Red Wolf coming in in the T92, one kill, four thousand nine hundred ninety-one damage. T92 putting in work. Alpha in the Fosh, uh, one kill, thirty-nine oh nine. Dirty D4, two kills, twenty-eight twelve. Odd Bug of the Tehran, one kill, twenty-six eighty-six. Peacebreaker in that QL, one kill, twenty-one twenty-five. Uh, Jeff in his 155, two kills, 2008. Devil's Curse in that 261, three kills from Artie, uh, 1620. Chicken in the LT with 1484, but almost 4K assisted. Uh, Twitch in the Avery, 395. And it looks like Lost Hope and Toasty Tot were not able to land a shot. And over on the U.S. can side, we've got Cupid in the Tehran. One kill, 3,556 damage. We've got Huels in the 183, one kill, 1723 damage. Tovar in the T100, he did manage to grab a kill. 1,174 damage, 1,255 assisted. Torch in the Arnie, excuse me, uh, 1,170 damage. Demon in the Nemesis, 1,125 damage. Crazy Mage in the 261, 960 damage. Harley and the Lehman Russ, 897 damage, 448 assisted. Big Cat and Wooten in Nemesis and CS with donuts. And then we've got Darley in the Supercon with 144 assisted. Dragon in the Avery, 672 assisted. You know, I've never understood that about custom games. How do the well, two people, like, donuts place higher than people that have assisted damage? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> make it make sense. <laughs> it's what it is. But no, that over on Forcad side, they had four kills total, and over six thousand damage come off of just artillery. I mean, those artists put in work up top. Yeah, it was definitely very gnarly. AMX M454, what a tank. Two stern tigers, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm not even looking at it yet, I'm just going through, like, look at, looking at the tank tech tree right now. Because I know it's going to be a minute before they all get picked, I want it to be a surprise. Oh, uh, four CAD's almost done. US Kansas has four tanks left. Yeah. Oh. There's only five total tanks left to be picked. I am going to step away for like a minute here real fast. I do have to use the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, you're good, bud. Oh, yes, they are. All right, well, while, uh, while we're waiting for SK to do a couple last-minute picks, um, over on the forecast side, we are in the M454, the E4, the 60PP, the QL, the MAL, uh, the Avery, double therm, the machine, uh, 261 making the appearance again, and another M454. Over on us can side, I think we're now with the Avery, uh, double already with a 58 and a 261 Tehran, IS4, LT, oh, they're going triple already this time, a second 261, the CS, the EVR 105, Well, it looks like that, uh, those last few picks that you said, they're going to go ahead and uh, do a little switcheroo. Yeah, they just, uh, <laughs> they just do a little switcheroo there. Now, <laughs> they may need you to go play. They may need me to go play. I can say honestly, I have not okay, been Okay, okay, okay. Darley, uh, accidentally left. She's coming back. There we go. Now, it looks like uh, over on the can they are going to run the three already set up again. All right, they're going to bring well, out the Victorio and a Chieftain. In all, in all honesty, though, over there on Forecast side, they have triple already. They're just not all squares. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Darley coming out with a quad already oh. in the T92. Wait, no, Harley Quinn like deselected. Looks like, they're, uh, looks like they're probably going to put Harley in her Valor-ish tank of some sort. This is... Demon, you're not ready. Oh, no, she put the bat jump. Oh, my they, God. They are quad arties. Oh, my God. 
Demon's literally playing this in spite. <laughs> this is absolute toxicity. <laughs> but this guy cancer be free. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, here we go. <laughs> what's what's crazy is if you look at the hit point matchup. Oh, oh, <laughs> they didn't switch sides. Oh, they did not do said things. Are you going to are you going to throw that in their chat real fast? Uh dirty already brought it up. Okay. Um Looks like they may just play it out. It's highly possible with Tolovar taking 1300 damage real early and getting ran out of that hole he was in. It looks like 4K going to be really aggressive here. I mean, they have an overmatch with them running four Arties. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, Harley and Jules just going to be in trouble here any second. Ooh. Big hit on Torch. Did someone just get racked? Why did my screen shake? No. I'm okay. Sure. Probably a Hardy Realm or something landed. Yeah, but I don't know. My screen didn't shake like that at all last game. It was very uh, spicy. <laughs> sure. Well, now that Forecat has 90% of their team on beach, US Can has to lock down that beach here. They, they just have to. You gotta pin them in those uh, bottles. I don't think they're gonna have the tanks. I mean, the Tron's going down to hell, back up the ice fort, but they're uh, not gonna have enough tanks. 60 QL, the M454, a Miles. Yeah. Well, it looks like uh, at least three of the four Arties are looking that direction. Harley is spotted, though, in the back chat, Artie. Torch is over here trying to keep everything on that uh, on that zero line, the nine zero line back. Ooh. Tron just took a seven 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 roll from the sixty. Yeah, and it does look and like Tolvar goes Becker. down in light tank. Red Wolf does take a shot from I don't even know who that was from. Maybe Demon. <laughs> I can't even tell anymore. <laughs> oh yeah, all these tanks are lined up real close together. Oh my, Red Wolf is Red Wolf is taking some punishment here. Big Cat put I'm, in some work in that Centauro up there. Bouncing some important shots. Storm Tigers oh. down to a two shot. Well it looks like they're trying to get Red Wolf out here. That'd now, be a Harley big kill right now. They are trying to focus out Harley. The machine goes on reload, does not get the kill. Big Cat takes down one of the M454s. Shots, good shots. Dude, what are we oh, gonna see here? Oh, dragging in on the Sturm. Oh, no. Bob and weave, Bob and weave. <laughs> well, Sturm is on reload, so he could he could be looking for some backup here from Wooten. Wooten's got his own problems with Jeff right in his face. The Sturm turned off. Oh no, Dragon ran into Big Cat. I believe you were talking about the wrong tank when you said that. <laughs> uh, maybe, I don't even know. Big Cat. Big Cat is a. Uh... Oh. oh, Dragon goes down. Now, Big Cat gonna be in 2v1 here. Ooh, it's yeah, 2v1 not is some high, and some high damage heavy tanks. Jeff gonna get the reload. Oh, the mouth's on the fire. It's like somebody's on fire. I'm seeing it tick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. To bring this back from uh from where it was in the in the HP standing is quite phenomenal, actually, in my opinion. Yeah, everybody just needs to focus the 60 TP when he comes in on Demon here. You say Demon uh, is lit. It's like the chief of the torch goes down to the machine. Demon goes down. These guys are in shotgun mode. No, they're not. 
One of them is, one of them's not. Now nah, they're focused on the 60. Oh, carcass and long. That's uh, that's definitely unfortunate. Well, Mage does manage to get another shot in. Looks like Luton's the only one left here over there on beach. All right, looks like he is going to run into the 261 first. See, look, it's definitely a sticky situation when you run into Artie first. <laughs> oh, oh, the shot only tracks. Depression. Skirm Tiger misses. Oh no, another track. Oh, and depression. <laughs> All right. Well, over on US Can side, you got Big Cat putting in some work over there in that Centauro. One kill, 3,223 damage, 671 assisted. Demon in 261 dropping a spicy 3,049 damage, 864 assisted. Crazy Mage and the other 261. Three kills on 2,648 damage. That's that's a really good game. Darley in the T92, one kill on 2,564 damage, 197 assisted. You got Dragon in the 13105, running on 1,907 damage, 1,041 assisted. And apparently I'm not allowed to read. Oh, I still can read the rest. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, you got Cupid in the Terran, 1,808 damage, 1,927 assisted. You got Torch in the Chieftain, 1,149 damage, 2,359 assisted out of that Chieftain. You got Hules. Oh, no, so we're just to buy artillery. You got Hules in the <laughs> IS-4, 851 damage. You got Tovar in the T-100 LT, 284 damage, 268 assisted. And you got Harley in the Bat Chat. <laughs> 278 damage, 431 assisted, and Wooten in the CS, no raw damage, but 488 assisted. That was unfortunate at the end of his game. Uh, the hit all game for him, all he could do is hit tracks, dude. Yeah, he definitely just could, unfortunate. He was not panning for him. No, it's rough. Avery, man. Go to the Avery, you'll never have to worry about that. <laughs> well, <laughs> tell that to Twitch play. <laughs> Uh, okay, I'm just gonna make this real quick over on the four CAD. Uh, Toasty in the 60TP, three kills, 36.95. Chicken in the Machine, three kills, 36.83. Dirty Knee, four, two and E, six, 63. Devil, uh, one kill, 22.05. Peace in that QL, one kill, 18.19. Uh, Jeff in the M4, 54, two kills, 16.70. Red Wolf in the M4, 15.42. Uh, the Sturm and Lost Hope with 15.17. The rest of the guys just not getting much done. Uh, the mouse did have one kill, 231. All right, Demon, how was uh, that controlled chaos on that last match? <laughs> it was just, that whole set was like too much for one caller, man. It, that uh, was yeah, absolutely 11, insane from our side. We couldn't keep up with people. it on our side, so. <laughs> no, no. 11, uh, 11 v 11 is uh, really hard to call. You yeah, don't know it where was, to look. It was, it was pretty much just a kind of play for yourself thing. Yeah. But, you know, that's it, the whole fun like of it. It like, was a lot of funsies. Yeah, we were just, you know, having fun with it. No, well, I mean, that's what, that's what this is all about. Just go out, have fun. So. Oh. Like King looking for a, a roll them, shoot them, trim for a Saturday night. That'd be fun. Ooh. But, all right, guys, that's going to do it for the stream. Stay tuned. I will send you guys off to, uh, and yeah, we'll raid somebody. I don't know who yet, but we'll find somebody. Uh, Clout, thanks for coming out. Oh, 100%. Thanks for having me. All right, guys. Let's go do it for tonight. I'll be back this weekend with more streams. Laters.